Do you know what are the different open source database present on Azure? So when you look into this, we have these different, you know, community managed databases on Azure that are also not only owned by Microsoft, but other companies. So the first one is that we have the Azure's original and its own Azure SQL database. So creating a SQL database on cloud that is owned by Microsoft Azure. Then we have uh, Azure database for MySQL. So if your organization is already using MySQL, this is one of the open source one which you can use for MySQL, but on cloud. Then we have post GRE SQL. So this is something similar to MySQL, but this time it's like open source post GRE SQL that is compatible with the cloud. And we also have one more that is MariaDB. So these all are related to relational database and the one Azure Cosmos DB, it is related to big data. That is um, non-relational data, big data or semi-structured data. These are the different Azure databases that are available. Now we will look further into the ones that are specific for relational database. First, we will learn exactly what is MySQL, what is MariaDB, what is PostGRE SQL. So the first criteria that we are going to distinguish them is development. So originally developed by MySQL AB, now owned by Oracle Corporation. So MySQL is owned by Oracle. Then MariaDB is something that is forked from MySQL by the original developers due to concerns over Oracle acquisition of MySQL. That means MariaDB and MySQL do the same thing. They give us a database related to relational data. Then we have PostGRE SQL. PostGRE is owned and developed by PostGRE SQL Global Development Group. So now we have understood that where they have originated from MySQL, MariaDB and PostGRE SQL. Then licensing. So MySQL has dual license. MariaDB is open source and PostGRE SQL is again open source. Compatibility. MySQL is fully compatible with MariaDB and most applications developed by MySQL. Vice versa, similarly, MariaDB is fully compatible with MySQL since they both have been forked from the same, you know, code. PostGRE SQL is highly compatible with SQL standards and offers broad compatibility with other database systems. Related to features, MySQL offers a rich set of features for managing and querying the data, including multiple storage engines and replication options. So this was about MySQL. Then MariaDB provides enhanced performance, stability, new features while maintaining the compatibility with MySQL. Then for PostGRE SQL is known for a bit advanced features and complex queries and advanced data types and robust transaction capabilities. So basically MySQL was there first, then MariaDB evolved out of MySQL and PostGRE is fully new, more complex and more robust. Then related to community, they all have big and strong community of developers and users. When it comes to popularity, one of the most popular databases is MySQL since it was like the first one or the legacy one. Then after that, MariaDB gained its popularity because of Oracle going to MySQL and after that related to post GRE SQL it is widely used in various applications particularly in in scenarios requiring advanced features and standard compliance so this was all about what exactly are these MySQL MariaDB and you know post GRE SQL 
Then we have to learn about the Azure database for MySQL. Like what exactly Microsoft Azure has to offer when it comes to MySQL. So Azure database for MySQL is fully managed relational database service provided by Microsoft Azure. So if your organization already has database on MySQL, they can easily move it to cloud using this particular service that is Azure database for MySQL. It is normally used for web applications and mobile application. So the database engine, so the engine of the database would be MySQL, but the infrastructure will be of Microsoft Azure. So using Azure database for MySQL, you can easily create your relational database on MySQL without taking care of backups, scalability, security, patching, or monitoring. It also provides features like automatic backup, restore, high availability, and automatic failover. So the last point is very important. Azure Database for MySQL is compatible with MySQL Community Edition and supports popular MySQL tools and frameworks, making it easy for developers to migrate existing MySQL applications to Azure. If you do not, if you already have MySQL, MariaDB or PostGRE, the open source ones, then you can easily migrate. If not, you can also use the o Azure Database for SQL, that is the own database engine that is owned by Azure. Then the other database engine is MariaDB. So again, Azure database for MariaDB is a fully managed relational database service provided by Microsoft Azure based on MariaDB database engine. So again, it has the same features what MariaDB has, but this time it is on cloud. So you do not have to worry about backup, maintaining, maintaining stuff, operational stuff, infrastructure stuff, and different things. So if your organization already has relational database on MariaDB engine on premises, they can easily use the service on cloud and just migrate. Then at the last, we have Azure database for PostGRE SQL. So this is a fully managed relational database service provided by Microsoft based on PostGRE SQL database engine. So all these three services, that is MySQL, MariaDB, and the last one, PostGRE SQL, these all are the relational databases that are present within Azure, but the engine is of their original organization or their original forms. So it offers a powerful and flexible database solution that's fully compatible with PostGRE SQL Community Edition. And again, like the previous ones, they have automatic backup, point in time restore, high availability with automatic failover, high security, scalability, data encryption, security, network isolation, and all the different features that Microsoft Azure provides. And it also supports various post-GRE SQL extension and features enabling the users or the consumers to leverage advanced functionalities such as geospatial data processing, full text search, and JSON document storage. So, again, if your organization has their database on PostGRE SQL, they can easily use different services for data migration. And, you know, they can have the database on cloud, but using the PostGRE SQL database engine.